hello everyone it's christina and welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to be showing you all how i prep my hair when i'm getting ready to protective style so if you want to see my process from beginning to end then keep watching because i'm going to get started with that right now also you guys i will be washing my hair in the kitchen and this is not a wash day video so I'm going to start out with my Shea Moisture's Low Porosity Protein Free Shampoo. Um, if you watch one of my wash day videos, I can't remember which one it is, but I told you guys that I really like this shampoo because it is very clarifying. And I am starting out on a seven day old wash and go where I use some wet line extreme gel. So uh, I use a pretty good bit of gel. And so I needed something that was really going to strip all of that gel out of my hair and really clarify my hair and this shampoo is great for that so all i'm going to do is work this into my hair really good until i feel like that i got it clean after i rinse that out i'm going to go in with my shea moisture's intensive hydration shampoo you all know this is one of my favorite shampoos it is very moisturizing and the reason why i am going in behind the clarifying shampoo with this is because the clarifying shampoo will strip your hair so this right here is just going to put that moisture back into my hair after i got finished clarifying it Right after rinsing that out, I'm going to make my four sections and I'm going to go in with my Miel uh, Protein Deep Conditioner. And right on top of that, I am going to put on my Mish Indulge uh, Moisturizing Conditioner. Um, I like to use a protein conditioner right before I get ready to protect the style to give my hair that strength because I'm not going to be washing it for a little while. And then I also like to go in on top of that with a moisturizing deep conditioner because that protein deep conditioner does dry my hair out a little bit. And like I mentioned in one of my other videos, I seen another YouTuber do this. So ever since I started, um, ever since I seen that video, whenever I use the protein deep conditioner, I always pair it with a moisturizing deep conditioner so that it does not dry my hair out. So all I'm going to do is put both of these deep conditioners on and then I'm going to comb it through with my Tangle Teaser brush and then I'm going to put the bag on my head after I finish all four sections and then I'm going to sit up underneath my hooded dryer for about 30 minutes. Okay, so after I finish rinsing out this deep conditioner, um, I am going to keep my four sections and then I just twist them up. And the way I dry my hair when I get ready for protective style, I try to get out as much water as possible. So I'm going to go in with this little turban uh, thingy. I couldn't find my turby twist. So I had to get this right here and this is sort of like the Turby Twist except it's more like a t-shirt type um, towel. It's called a t-shirt towel. I had got it from Walmart but I couldn't find my Turby Twist so this was the next best thing. But I do this to try to get as much water out of my hair as possible. I like my hair to be dry whenever I get ready to do my protective styles. When I'm not going to blow it out I do try to squeeze out as much water as possible. All right, so after I let my hair dry for a little bit, I am just going to go in with my leave-in conditioner. And the leave-in conditioner that I am going to be using is my Mish leave-in conditioner. This stuff is very moisturizing and I love using this, especially since I'm getting ready to protective style. I want to have some very moisturizing leave-in in. So I did use a pretty good bit of this. And all I'm going to do is put this on all four of my sections and then I'm also going to brush it through when I get done with each section. Okay y'all, so now that I have my leave-in in, all you're going to see me doing in this next upcoming clip right quick is just doing a length check. Every time I protective style, I always do a length check just to see how much length I get and how much growth I get while I'm protective styling because like I've made mention quite a few times, my hair grows a whole lot faster when I am not messing with it. So in this upcoming scene, you'll just see me um, doing a length check. I grabbed some hair in the front. I did both sides in the back. I did both sides on the side and then I also did, did the top. So that's all I'm going to be doing right quick is a very quick length check 
Okay, so after my length check, I am going to start making my sections for my protective style. And then once I get my first section done, I am going to go in with this fro butter. It is a solid, but once you scoop some of it out and rub it in your hands, it actually turns into an oil. It has a whole bunch of different oils in it, and I love this stuff. I also found out about this from another YouTuber, um, and she says that it helps with keeping your hair from reverting back. So that's the reason why I use it along with it having all of those different oils in it. So once I put that on my section, all you see me doing here is making my parts and then all I'm going to do is just plait up this back section. And the reason why I am plaiting my sections up like this and making these parts is because I am doing, I am using some crochet hair, but I am not doing cornrows. So this is how I do my hair. I prep my hair for my style. I make sections and rows and just plait them all up as if you were going to do a braid out. But um, yep, that's all I do to my hair, you guys. It's real quick and simple. This plaiting it up takes the longest out of everything, but once I get done i'll show you all what my hair looks like and then that's it for this video you guys so i hope it was helpful i hope you enjoyed it um if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you didn't like this video still give it a thumbs up um if you're not subscribed to my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you have any comments for me leave them down below and i will see you all in my next video when i actually get ready to do my protective style so until then you all have a great week Bye.